My name is Rachel Irwin and I'll be showing some abstract landscapes and some eco art, some 3D art that glows um, powered by solar lights. Eco art started catching my attention in high school and I've been working with that theme ever since. I work a lot with Surfrider Foundation and donate some profits to them. Basically environmental art is, is at the core. There's a lot of there's a lot of themes about change and interconnection, so whether it's human or environmental impermanence, I like to work with those ideas. With the Enlightened Jellies, I chose to work with plastic bags because I wanted to show how they can look like jellyfish when they're in the ocean and a lot of predators mistake them for food. And so I just manipulate the bag and house it in these upcycled glass jars and I light them with solar lights. Well, I work with kids a lot because my degree was in art education and I was making toys with them out of plastic bottles and the jellyfish were floating from one side to the next. They got to play with it like a toy and I thought, these are actually really beautiful the way they move. And if I could pair it with light and have them glow, it can attract people and catch their curiosity about the topic. It's to share ideas and open up dialogue, whether it's about human impermanence or environmental impermanence, change and interconnection, the ideas of Anicca and Anatta. It's just to kind of share with others and get them talking and learn from people and maybe introduce them to something new. Right now it's Manifest Art and Wellness on Facebook. So facebook.com slash Manifest Art and Wellness. And I'm also on Etsy, etsy.com slash shop slash Manifest Art.